kind of I don't know how is it possible but every single week we get over 10 games somehow they somewhere coming. they keep coming every they week it's like YouTube that like four years yeah. of content is added to YouTube every like day or something I, I, like, I keep uh, like losing the sense of buying games anymore well, you you would buy game. Why would you buy games? I if, don't know. If you are subscribed we, we to our used, channel, we used to buy games. I remember those I days. I remember. But anyone but who subscribed to this, this channel, video. you know that you don't need to buy games anymore. And if you're buying games, well, maybe subscribe first and just see if you actually need to buy games because there's a lot and there are there are some big games yeah. coming out. These are not all like little indie and platforms. All of these games that we're going to list. You're gonna find the links in the description, so you, you're gonna need to not search for them. That's right. Let's start with Landfall Archives. Hmm. That is uh, to steal and play previously unrealized games, demos, interactive live shows, and even an unrelated version of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. What? Is it like mix of the games? Unre it is! An unreleased version. Wait, you play games in you the game? What, yes. am, what am I looking at? M multiple games in one game because in here it's a meta game. Yeah. Yeah, you can just okay. you enter inside game and you play game. Wait. Looks pretty. W that's okay, that's, that's this cool. is like an ultimate game. Wow, overwhelming positive areas. It's a game we of might, games. We might find the game of the game. And it was released last week. Caleb, who has time to play the game of all the games? <laughs> Who has time to do that? Not us, which is why you should okay. tell us, should we play Landfall Archives? Uh, this uh, is now I mean, number one on the list. This looks, looks, looks really intriguing. Then we go to... Why, Mikhail? Why? Well, why, why actually, you do this to actually me? it's here. Traveler. Traveler Thank you. Prologue. Traveler Prologue is an adventure and exploration game with combat at its core. It looks like dancing. Really? But... Looks like dancing at its core. Uh, but okay, here we go. Pretty. Actually, right. it looks like a uh, low budget Forsaken. Yeah. Or maybe uh, a and kind of a knockoff Final Fantasy. Yeah. This was and also this was released yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's okay. that's kind of cool. cool. Postal is well known for its um, over the top yeah everything or, yeah yeah like i wanted to say 18 plus but it's more like 50 plus <laughs> 18 plus <laughs> so it's a violence um bad words everything you All can imagine things. that you should not do you can do usually in these kind of games yeah and this one is april fool april fool postal so postal royale is it online? No, single it's player. It's probably just a virus. Like <laughs> you and probably, yeah. <laughs> By the way, we can't. We didn't play any of these games. Uh, if there's a virus. There should not be since it's on Steam. Because this is not part of the postal yeah. series. This is Pustal ah, Royale. I see. I didn't notice. Thank you. But that's definitely yeah. April. Yeah. And April's Pool. Okay. But it's still a game and it's free to play. Yeah. So yeah. maybe give it a try. What about thirteen? Uh, I. Eve? I, I think it's supposed to be one view. I, I, I'm not sure. <laughs> a girl abandoned in the basement of a hospital for some reason escaped the hospital, mm -hmm. avoiding the doctor who Ooh. abandoned the girl in the basement. Ooh, Complete the story scary. through hidden foreshadowings and various devices throughout the map and find out why the doctor abandoned the girl in the basement. It looks great. And there's a mix of... Uh, like a side scrolling and first person mm -hmm, interesting mm -hmm. that's always interesting the murder of sonic the hedgehog absolutely i didn't know he's dead is he, he is now well uh it says here uh, the hedgehog was murdered get to the bottom of the mystery in the brand new adventure i never played adventure oh. i feel like i read a headline that said this is much better than anyone expected. And it's from Sega? Yeah, it's from Sega. And it's, it's free? Real. It's real. It's, it's free? It's the real deal. I mean, it's, it, was, it was released one day before 1st of April, so this, a week is, ago. this is not April. It's yeah. not an April Fool's joke. Okay. Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. Ooh. You this, know the series? This I is do. a. Famous the TV season. show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty course. good. So in Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, you'll take command of the colonial fleet in defense of the 12 colonies during the first Cylon War. Wow. And this is and usually bad. And it's free only up till 
uh, the Monday, right? 9th of April, which is that Sunday. That is Sunday, this Sunday. So if you're watching this video, wow. get that first. It's usually 30, 37, oh, 37 euros, euros and cool. it's free now. It looks cool. Yeah. It does wow. look cool. I mean, I don't know when we'd have time to play a big space Ooh, epic that, game, but that's there's awesome. A, this is a awesome. great deal. It's a 3D tactical game. Mm -hmm. It's not so the like same an XCOM And it's single player and online PvP, online co op. Wow. There it is. This is there it. it is. This is this why is you it. subscribe to yeah. our channel, guys. This for is stuff quite, like this. This is quite rare on this Steam. Bit, yeah. Next, Disfigure Prologue mm. is a top down shooter, roguelite, in which you fight countless grotesque creatures shrouded in darkness. Choose from a variety of upgrades to create unique builds each run and survive. Mm. This is like Nuclear Throne Horror Edition. Ooh, yeah. Lots of shooting. <laughs> we know how you like shooting. What about survive? Uh, oh, so survive. Yeah, survive. Yeah, sur survive. I get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, a card game. It's a card game and an original uh, counter deck building game that can be played in countless ways. Select a party of five heroes and fight against other players. And it's single player online. So you can mm -hmm. play it with others as well. Mm -hmm. Next is Kagura Survivors Endless Night. And this is an anomaly is creating tears in space time and causing parallel worlds to converge. Published April 1st, 2023. I see. So just I just see. keep an eye out for yeah. that. It doesn't look But bad. it looks yeah. yeah. It looks like a real game. It's uh, it looks like it. It's a single player, free to play. Mm -hmm. Try it mm -hmm. out. Or here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is the, yeah, this is it. The Elder Scrolls Online is now free to play for 10 days. For nine days, if you see this video. That's right. Uh, but still, like, I've. So till the end of the next week. Yep. That's pretty good. I've had some free weekends with the Elder Scrolls Online, and a weekend is not enough time mm -hmm. to really figure out well, everything the game has I to offer. I can tell you there's over 100,000 very positive reviews. Uh, if you like any of the Elder Scrolls games, and if you don't, mm. you probably haven't tried them. Mm. Well, this Nothing. one is old, but there's a lot of DLCs. And if you like it, then you can buy it for pretty good sale, 70% off. So on. just six euros. So yeah. try it for a few days. And if you know you want to keep playing it after the, the trial yeah. ends. But so you, like there are holidays coming up for a, a lot of countries. Yeah. We have the Easter holidays in front of us. You could play a lot of the Elder Scrolls online in a few days. I yeah. could. Yeah. Yeah. We could just get lost in Tamriel. Definitely. Mm -hmm. And a few of our fans doing the live stream point out that these games are free on Epic. I don't know. It, they're probably newly free to Epic and it was released uh, some day ago. Mm -hmm. But let's give it a shot. The first one is Gravewood High, mm. which is looks like online game. And it is up to six players. Okay. Co-op. And it's a single player also. And I guess it is one of these games where one is the killer uh, and other, other five escapes, okay. I guess. And there's some puzzles. Destructible and environments, randomized yeah. level layout, smart opponent. Yeah, so mm -hmm. with allies and rivals. Okay. And there's one more. Or what about Skotos? This also looks like a horror game, I guess. Grab your lantern and plunge into the darkness of Skotos, a terrifying first-person platforming Platform. game that okay. will make you brave the darkness to hmm. survive. I didn't expect that. Interesting. Ooh, monsters. If you are afraid of heights, this might not be the best game for you. The Touch is another horror. Ugh. This time... This, this is usually a very short game. Yes, even this one. Approximately five minutes of what? gripping terror. What? And eerie atmosphere. Immerse yourself in a world where something sinister watches from the shadows. No. No, it doesn't work. Either. Okay. But you should, you should give it a it, five minutes. It usually takes a few, like a bit more than five minutes to, to really to frighten you. me. Like, well, well, this sounds like a challenge. <laughs> at least six or seven. Okay. How about The Seeker? This is a very different type of game. You are a glowing ball. Yeah. Bouncing around and trying to solve puzzles and bounce off With of things. With human and, and robotic leftovers. Is it multiplayer? Weird. Okay. 
I this is on Indie Gala. You'll be able to claim it for free, keep it, keep it forever in your library. Mmm, that's huge randomness in the level. Procedural alarm system. Okay, Can you have like degrees of randomness? I feel like it's just random or it's not random. Can you have like <laughs> like I don't know. huge random? I don't know. How about this random game on Opera GX, which means you can claim it on this uh, Opera GX browser, that is the internet browser that we're using now for looking for free games mm -hmm, like this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you just claim it, yours, it's yours forever. And it is messy, pixelated, this RPG, time-based, auto-attacking roguelite auto, on a quest. Auto-attacking To be a stronger and defeat the most menacing of creatures it kind of looks like it's inspired by a vampire survivor okay, okay. something but like maybe that. more like an idol game maybe mm -hmm. maybe let us know maybe. guys nomad survival and epic epic it's quite epic these wow. weeks yeah we have lots of complaints of saying why isn't epic giving yeah. away good games it's only there will be like no good games before world games this is the time Hello. before the World Games. There will probably not be as good games on the World Games as these. Because this, Dying these two Light? weeks might be better yeah. than the Vault Games. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Dying Light, guys. Dying Light is huge. We have a en review up for it already. Enhanced Edition. If you know, if you want to know what Enhanced Edition means, watch the beginning of our review with the funny skit. It's enhanced. But some DLCs. The, Which one you're gonna find out? Special yeah. DLCs. So that's incredible. We've been expecting that for years. Yeah. That it finally should be free. Happened. Finally happened. Yeah. And there was supposed to be a blazing uh, sales, but it was replaced last minute with shapes. So we still hope the blazing sales are coming a few weeks later. But this one is a little bit to Automachef that we got before. Automachef. For free, yeah. Because this is more. Well, this is. Well, creating a it machine. needs to be explained very fast, in a very, in a very complex way. That's why we made less than four minutes review, so you should watch it to see what you should expect from this game. And if that wasn't enough, stay tuned for next week, because then you'll be able to claim two pretty exciting games as well. That is Second Extinction. And Mordhau. Mordhau. Yeah, these are both maybe not exactly triple A, but double A. Beautiful graphics, lots of action. Uh, there's lots to and do. And both of them you can play online. Right? Also, yeah. Also that, yep. Yeah. So that is all of the free games for this week. Uh, Michal, what is your your choice of... There's so many games. Which, which I one? I kind gonna... of get intrigued with this one. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. It's kind of intriguing. Yeah. Traveler. Uh, on, yep. Honestly, I th I think I might try Elder Scrolls Online again. Elder Scrolls Online. I, I, yeah. I'm a huge fan of Elder Scrolls. Where is it? This is. I you know when I tried yeah. it before I. But you know it's from 2014, and that's. And the MMO thing. You, nine, I, nine years. Wait, no, less seven. I don't know. It's old. <laughs> it's old. <laughs> wait, it's, it's late here. So. It is nine years. It's nine. It's nine years. Nine years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's nine. Yeah, it's nine, nine years, years ago. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Elder Scrolls Online is nine years yeah. old. <sighs> when it came out, like we were just like five years old. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I've always bounced off of MMOs. I've tried this one. Yeah. I couldn't really get into it. But uh, a yeah. few more days. I'm more of a single player guy. Yeah. So. I would but go with free, this one. But it's free. Yeah. It's all, well, it's all free. Let us know in the comments which one interests you the most. And if somehow you're not subscribed, well, this is the time to change that so you don't miss anything. Yeah, probably means that you don't like free games. So probably okay. not reason to watch it up until now. That, that, that right? It's okay if you like to pay for all of your games. That's and, okay. And, and don't we have an idea review for that. That's that right. is the deals of the week. That's right. That's true. You should watch, you should watch that instead. Yeah. Perhaps. <laughs> but enjoy your weekend and week of free games. We will be back next week with more free games. So stay tuned and see you next time. Bye. Bye.